just think for the grand opening of the marketplace, we need some grand entertainment. Oh, and not just grand, very grand. I got it. We could give a dance recital. <laughs> Something big! Something everyone will come see. Something with star power. <laughs> you want a big star? Hit Cherry Jam! <laughs> Singing and 
know, the words just kind of came to me. Am I ever glad they did? Thank you. It's perfect. Would it be okay if I used your words in my song? Of course. I'm Strawberry. Hi, Strawberry. This is Pupcake and Custard. Oh, so cute. And what's your name? Uh... Buttercup. Nice to meet you, Buttercup. Are you... <laughs> Do you smell cherry blossoms? Oh, um... <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't smell anything except strawberries. Uh, you were asking? Oh, uh, yes, I, I was gonna ask if you're out here alone. Uh-huh, just sort of driving through, and I've always wanted to have a picnic. You've never had a picnic before? Uh, well, no. Well, I'll let you enjoy. It was nice to meet you, Buttercup. Nice meeting you, too. Thank you for your help. Sure. Come on, guys. Back to the harvest. <laughs> Just like I hoped it would be. Cheers! <laughs> would like to extend a very big welcome to you and your entire entourage. <laughs> My entourage? You know, the people who go everywhere with you and wave at you hand and foot? Well, I kind of thought it'd be fun to kind of get away and come here on my own. I don't have an entourage with me. You do now! About Strawberry. Oh, shush. We're keeping you a secret until tomorrow. Come park over here. Here she goes! Make Perry for Jerry Jam! Are you a superstar? <laughs> Excuse me? Miss Jam? Oh, no. Please, call me Cherry. The actual for real Cherry Jam wants me to call her by her first name? <laughs> Just try to think of me as one of you. Excuse me, but why the sleeping day? We thought you always sleep in your fabulous tour bus when you're away from home. Not this time. I was looking forward to, you know, sleeping under the stars. Huh? You mean, like a camp out? Exactly, a camp out. Oh, do we have the perfect camping spot for you? Uh, yeah, that's right. Just stay right here, uh, relax, and we'll get it all ready for you. Yeah, let's go, girls. Oh, you're gonna love it. Why did you tell her that? We can't let her camp out. You know what she's used to? Five-star luxury. Six-star. If we let her sleep in some old sleeping bag, she'll never want to come back again. So, here's the plan. Do you guys remember the article that you can tell me? Is it eight Now, it's really not much. Probably not what you're used to. We hope it's comfortable enough for a star. A star of super magnitude. That means really, really big. Well, what do you think? It is really big, isn't it? Don't you want to see the inside? <laughs> of course. We copied your bedroom from your article. Bedroom of a star in very big glitz and glamour. Everything you have when you're at home has been duplicated here. Well, probably not exactly, but we did our best. <laughs> Thank you. It's very thoughtful of you. This is a camp out fit for a star. That's what my managers and my agents and my entourage would say. Ooh, her entourage. Well, See you in the morning. <sighs> wow, just what I'd hoped for. Miss Jam? Cherry! 
pod party? Oh no, they can't know that I've lost my voice. They'll be so let down if I can't sing for the grand opening. She doesn't like us so much. She didn't even come to her own Brownberry pie party. Refills? Anybody? If I have any more tea, I'm gonna float away. Maybe she didn't get her invitation? Maybe she's still in makeup? We better face facts. She knew it wouldn't be as good as she's used to, so she didn't bother. Well, should we? Might as well not let a perfectly good boomberry pie go to waste. <laughs> Yeah. 